All right, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf your one and only, and today we're gonna be playing some more Pirates Online. Oh dear God, we gotta go out and sink some ships. I forgot about that. It's gonna be the Arn Walls. I don't remember what those are. I'm pretty sure those are like war galleons. Yee, I don't think I want to fight those, but we're gonna, we have to. All right, we found it. Uh, it is, it is a galleon. It's not a war galleon though. It's level 20, I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's level 20. Which is good enough for me. As long as it's not like nothing like really OP. Actually, should we try and hit it? Ah, oh, yeah, they're right. It doesn't take damage because it does expect you to be on there. Okay. So I have to be on there until they all hit. That's actually really dumb. Uh, switch to lightning. Can't escape me. Hold on, hold on. Perfect. All right, where's the next one? It's gonna be a little bit harder just because I gotta navigate through all these guys and find the next iron wall. I found a whole bunch of signals. <laughs> all right, let's go find our next target. All right, we found our next target. So I just remembered that we're supposed to be taking out other uh, Eastern trading ships. So pretty much that signals fair game. Just because that gives me the Kraken eyes that you guys had saw pop up. So I have to be attacking everything. He will go down. Maybe I should continue to use motor cannonballs. Yeah, they seem way better right now. I don't know the effect of the... Um, Lightning ones. I gotta read that. So I'm pretty sure it does add on like some kind of benefit. Well, then again, it does more damage just because uh, the side is injured. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, the lightning cannonballs do a lot more damage than the uh, normal cannonballs, and they're rank four. Okay, that makes sense. It does damage over time. I should probably start using those now and then. Then just switch over to different cannonballs. Noted. All right, let's go find the rest of these. Pretty sure our loot is gonna be full by the time we're done with this. Oh, this is the pirate's dream life. Selling the seven seas, looking for ships to take out. Oh, not those ships. Nah, nah. Nope, not that one. I, I don't know what you thought I said, game, but nah, not that one. I think I'm good. Oh, there goes a bloodhound over there. Where the hell are all the iron walls, man? I thought there was more out here. There's definitely more out here. Well, then again, they didn't say King's Head. They said they're all over here around Cutthroat and... A little volcano place over there. Hey, you're coming closer to me. I don't like that. Can you not? Now, please don't act wrong to me. I really don't need you, of all people, trying to fight me. Oh dear god, yep, uh, you turning around, that is not what I was expecting to fight, yep, um, not this place. Let's go back to Cutthroat and wait for some different ships. Dear god, um, this map is trying to get me killed. No, okay, there, there it is, they are all the way in the back, I'm gonna take out this ship. 
because I need uh, two more uh, Kraken eyes. Oh, nice. Okay, come on. What the hell kind of shot was that, buddy? Oh, my shots aren't any better. They all hit on top of your ship. Where's this other ship? I think he went all the way out there. Now we just need... Oh, we still need three of those. Well then. Well, at least we need one more Kraken Eye, so we can finish that quest. Whoever had that one. I don't actually remember who had it. What the hell? Somebody's all the way out there. Are they just trying to see how far they can get? <laughs> That was perfect. Down a little bit more. See, I'm really good with a cannonball sometimes. All the time. So I can't even say all the time, man. Because some of these times is like really off. I'm curious to what this guy is doing out here. I'm going to go see... Maybe it's something else that'll probably murder me. I've always been curious of what happens if I go out here. We are going to go see. Oh, it disappeared. Alright, ghost ship. Turning around. Yep, ain't going for that. You've already tricked me. I am gone. <laughs> All right, no, we gotta go find his last two arm walls. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and dock at Driftwood. Then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna change servers and see if we can find any enemies on there. Cause I've been searching for quite a while, and I'm actually curious uh, what loot I got. Hmm. Anything good? Let's see. Oh. Well, that's not, nope, I'm good. I already learned that that's actually trash. I'm good. But let's go ahead and change servers and see what else we can find. What? How, how did that ship die? I'm so confused. Alright, invisible things are killing these ships. Do we not see that as an issue? But we found a iron wall. Oh, okay. I was just sitting here like, wait, what is that noise? Oh, the two. Okay, cool. That just helps me out even more. I'm still quite puzzled what the hell just happened there. Oh my god, they're all here. Jeez, good thing I changed servers. Holy crap, where are you shooting? They know this be a pirate ship. Time to start blood. <laughs> about to say, I knew one of those had to be on. Alright, so this side is vulnerable.
This is actually pretty dangerous to be around these guys too. Especially in the middle of all... Are you changing directions, you freaking ship? Chill, man. Bro, where are you shooting? Yeah, I gotta get rid of this guy. He's literally gonna aggro onto me. Why are you so close? I know he wasn't aggroed onto me, but sooner or later he was going to. Especially with the way he was slowly creeping up. Alright. So, darn it, he's all the way over there. Don't you dare shoot. I think you're about to shoot. Okay. You didn't. Ah, I led my shot. It would have hit him. Like, I'm always off for, like, just a tad. Alright, that's our last one. Where's this guy? Alright, he's on, um, court. Alright, let's go give him his, um, crap he wanted. Well, actually, he just wanted me to sink ships. That's pretty much it. He didn't really ask me to gather anything. Rolling attack. I don't think I've ever seen that. Oh, that is one brave little um, spook. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna just let them take care of that. <laughs> I'm gonna just go on and deliver my quest. So apparently, the Kraken eyes are for the dock. Huh? I don't think I've even noticed that at all. Oh, the dock is only like 5% recruited. Oh, jeez. That means he has a lot more quests for me. Alright, here you go, buddy. Ah! Yes! All I gotta do is deliver it to Jack and I'm done. And we got our nades that I can eventually kill myself with. I, I actually wouldn't be surprised if it actually happened. <laughs> Oh, I get to test these out for the first time. Ooh. It's going to be quite something. And you know what? I think I know the perfect place to try them out to. We're going to go ahead and go to King's Head once we get them. <laughs> and we're going to try it on those um, group of soldiers that we had saw. Doesn't sound like the smartest idea, but you know. I'm not gonna question it. <laughs> I mean, you guys know it's been a while since I died in this series, you know. We might as well push a little bit of our boundaries and end off with a death. <laughs> if it if it doesn't work out, you know. But who knows? It probably could work. I could probably finish them off. Especially if the AI is still pretty much goofy. Oh yeah, for those of you guys who have like gaming backgrounds or no, like developers, designers, uh, editors, uh, they're actually hiring uh, new people for the game. So I recommend you guys look into it. It even says it on the launcher or on their homepage, which is actually pretty cool. Wait, what? Did I screw up? Um, do I not have the quest? I think I think I may have screwed up. I'm not sure. Do I need to buy 24 nades? Is that what you're telling me? It wouldn't really make any sense. 
So I guess I gotta go buy them. Um, where is the nearest gun place? Oh, it's actually right there. I'm just gonna buy extras for me. <laughs> Alright, so I got some nades. Supposedly, I'm supposed to turn them into Jack. But that's not how that works, then. This is... This is weird. Nope. I think this quest is actually bugged. Either we finished... Yeah, we finished it, but... Oh, okay. Oh, so I just wasted money. Oh, well. I guess I'll just go sell them. It's all good. I mean, I don't... That wasn't even that much. I think it was just like a thousand. I could easily earn that back. So let's go ahead and sell these back. And then I'm going to see you guys in... Well, I, actually, I got to talk to Doc first. Then I'll see you guys in King's Head and we'll end off the video there. With a little bit of a uh, experiment. <laughs> you see this chaos I've caused for my inventory. <laughs> yep. This is my life now. I have to live with this. Oh, yeah. I also figured out that you can't, like, drag your stuff between, uh, between pages. If anything, the trick to dragging them, you would just do this. Oh, or not. Nah, it doesn't even work that way. Um, they definitely need to do something about that, because some people really don't like their loot separated like that, because it's going to be weird. When you drag it onto here... You want to click it over, but the game automatically drops it, so that doesn't count. Yeah. Alright. We are done here. Gonna replace the knife. But that is also another way to change it there. But... Not sure if anybody wants to actually do all that. I said it would be easier if they just do it the way I pretty much said it would be easier to do. Instead of just switching it back and forth between slots and all that. That's way more effort than the than, uh, easier, quicker solution. Alright, let's go talk to Doc. Oh, dear God. Oh, my. Doc, you're asking for a lot. How much did your uh, progress go anyway? Just 10? Oh my god, you have several quests for us for sure. Oh my god, yep. <laughs> this quest is going to be a while before I'm done with it. Alright, I'll see you guys at King's Head. Alright, we're here. And this will be my first time ever using the nades in this game. Just because, like I said, I was really unable to use this just because membership blocked us off from like so much back then uh, what skills does it have see pocket slows people does fire damage uh, smoke bomb blinds enemies and siege watch out it's heavy but slows enemies for three seconds all right this is probably not the best idea but you know Oh, that's actually a lot of damage, jeez. Oh, that's gonna be difficult to hit them. Yeah, this is like the easiest farming ever. I can see why people do this now. Guys, actually, when I think about it, even if the enemies were fixed, they would be in a straight line and this would be way easier than what they are doing right now. Well then. 
Yep, I can definitely see why people do this. It's like super easy to level up the nades. And probably yourself too. I mean, there's nothing to keep me from doing this. <laughs> I, I feel like... I rule over these guys right now. <laughs> oh my god, there's a little bit lag, isn't it? Jeez. Probably got a skill point by now, too. But nades are pretty much really good for clearing out enemies. I can definitely say that. And now that I have these... I can easily clear them out, but, as you guys saw, I can do damage to myself, too, if enemies are too close. So I could potentially end up murdering myself. This is what I used to see people doing, like, every time I came to King's Head. Just for like a little bit of a quest or something. Do I have skill points? Let's see. Yeah, I do. Stink pot. So this is basically slow, huh? Oh, this is that's the hold attack. All right, how does this look? Oh, I don't have them. Uh huh. Well then, I should have bought the hold then. Hopefully one of these guys will drop it after I murdered him. Because that is possible. But yeah, it's super easy to just knock these guys down a peg. I can see why this was behind a uh, membership. <laughs> like, everything pretty much from... I think daggers were behind membership? I can't remember. If you guys uh, remember that, let me know. Because I'm pretty sure daggers weren't behind membership. Actually, no, I I think there were, just because I don't think I was ever using it. I think sword and shield and pistol, I said sword and shield. Okay, what game am I playing in my head? Sword and pistol were the only ones that were actually available to us. Now oh, these guys don't do much damage to me anyway. Well then, so even if that was the case, uh, you guys wouldn't even put a dent in me. <laughs> even if you guys were better AIs, only like 12 damage? Jeez. You guys need to step up your damage. Okay, all of you guys together can kill me, and I can kill myself. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, guys, this is where I'm going to end it. I'm going to finish off these guys and call it a day because I do want to try out some more VR games because I believe I have fixed my VR set. I think the issue with it was that my sensors were overheating not the headset itself so yeah that was the issue I think I solved it and hopefully it works and I'll bring some more VR games now and then on well, whenever I decide to upload them. See level 5 already. And it didn't even take all that long. Hey, this was the farm spark for nades. That's how you level them up, like, really quick. This is also how people... Well, other people leveled up sword. Just because they would just hit one one of them with sword, then just switch over to nade to finish them off. The same thing with voodoo doll. Uh, you can level up the pistol that way, just because you can't... There's a pirate code behind it. You can't, like, shoot humans with the pistol. So, yeah. I do want to try out the hold before we actually end off. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty nice. I didn't want to aggro you guys, to be honest. Honestly, didn't. But, that's fine. Alright, guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next video. And to then, 
He's out. Guys, I just want to get off.